Hello guys and welcome to a brand new video. Now today I'm going to start Cowboy Bebop. And I have to say something before starting that is number one, I know nothing about Cowboy Bebop. Only one thing that I know about this is that uh, it takes place in outer space as far as I know. Other than that, I know nothing. I only know the main character. That's it. So this is like a blind reaction and I have like always um, thought to watch Cowboy Bebop because obviously it is like uh, such a great anime as I've uh, like heard from other people and this is like one of the classics animes that you should uh, have watched uh, like another one is like Neon Genesis Evangelion <laughs> unfortunately I've not watched that as well but anyways uh, like I have like I had planned to watch this a long time ago but uh, unfortunately due to like lack of time and all of the seasonal animes that come out um, I've not been able to watch this so I thought like uh, one of the slots has been opened uh, in which like I today I was uh, like I did Tower of God so that slot has opened so I've thought like let me just give this like put this reaction on YouTube as well and uh, yeah like uh, this is my first time watching this and I'm quite excited because I've seen a lot of good things about it I've heard a lot of good things about this so yes and uh, Another thing is that I'm going to do two episodes a week, uh, obviously because of like uh, I have some plan to do uh, some other uh, animes as well. So I have to do two uh, episodes a week, otherwise uh, like my schedule won't catch up. So yeah, so episode one and episode two, uh, I'll be putting in this reaction and uh, in the midst I'll take a little bit of break and talk about the individual episodes. So yeah, without further ado guys, let's get started with Cowboy Beepa episode number one okay so i'll be putting the timers and the subtitles uh timer and the subtitles here sync it to whichever is your preference and let's get started okay so i'll be counting down three two one go <coughs> okay It's the main character as far as I know. Hmm. So he's some kind of um, like mercenary or something. Oh, okay, so, uh, okay, the opening. I've heard this opening a lot, so this is like nothing uh, new to me. Obviously, because it's, it's like such a good opening and like, like in a lot of, uh, what can I say, try, try to guess the anime openings and all. This is like one of the staple choice. Hmm. Okay. Like I'm not like uh, used to uh, only music openings. Uh, like there are like I think a countable few of the animes which has like openings where there are no what can I say uh, vocals. Uh, like this one and i can't remember like there were a few others as well which had only like music in the openings so this is quite rare and obviously this is like a lot old anime so yeah damn okay cowboy bebop 1998 asteroid blues Okay, I have to check one thing out. Like, when was this anime made? Like, th I know this is old, but I don't know the exact time, like exact year. Okay, the music is quiet. Hmm. 
Wow. Okay. Spike. Okay. I don't know what that is, but target. So they are like mercenaries, aren't they? I am syndicated teams. <laughs> Beef with bells. <laughs> Long. <laughs> Group and an enemy syndicate. Uh. Hmm. Okay, the bees. So that's going to like make him interested. We'll soon arrive at the gate. Wow, like the space travel is it's like like people often do this. That means like scientific progress has increased so much. Okay. Damn, imagine like one day we'll have our personal space <laughs> space uh, craft to travel between planets. Okay. Wow, that is like an odd looking spaceship. Oh no, okay, never mind. I thought like it was like odd looking, but. Oh, his hand is uh, prosthetic? <laughs> like, imagine just. Whipping out your spaceship to travel to a new planet. <laughs> oh boy. Oh wow, like this is like a human civilization. Proper. Attack that gate with all my might. Hmm. <laughs> oh, this must be that guy, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I forgot his name. Uh, the one they're after. And that must be his girl or whatever they were talking. Um. Okay. All right, here at the <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, what the? Oh, I told you he's going to pierce his eyes. Hmm, that doesn't look good. Like. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Oh. Alright. Well. Oh, so everything's like slow motion for him? Like, is that the effect of the drug? Okay, wow, the animation is quite smooth. Like, I did not expect this. Okay, I'm feeling dizzy with this, like... Oh... Damn, he can see the bullet! Wow! Uh, okay... Well, that is a powerful drug. Hmm. Oh, Spike is here. Hmm. She'll meet a woman. Again. Hmm. All right. Yeah, he has a prosthetic in one. Wow, the cat is still here. <laughs> oh, someone's here. Okay, damn. Okay, what was his name? Jet, I think, isn't it? Yeah. Empty. Okay. <laughs> yeah, he's hungry as well. Well, okay, he has seen him. Mm -mm. And all right. I think he like Anna. What can I say? Did he understand that something was up with the guy? Is that is this the girl that fortune teller was talking about? Like death and all. Oh, he's eating. <laughs> what the? <heck>? Damn. <laughs> Well, that's a good way to <laughs> like match <snatch> food, <laughs> like put it in your mouth. <laughs> that's the best method. Mm. 
<laughs> Mars. Oh. Hmm. Will be happy. Oh, okay. She, she's pregnant. Oh. Oh, he's a bounty hunter. Oh yeah, a mercenary in a way. Okay. Okay. You snatched something. Okay. Uh, did he like uh, put some kind of a tracking device in him or something like that? Like, that is like the most Well, here we go jealousy Jet is here. <laughs> oh, uh, the ship's name is Bebop then. Bloody eye, yes. Oh, he did he snatch that? Oh, I thought like he put some kind of tracking device. Okay, so that fortune teller was talking about this. Uh, the red eyed coyote and the woman. Yeah, constantly living with fear or uh, with the fear of being caught. Oh, great. <laughs> Damn, these like people, there's like always these type of people that anywhere you go. That place there was the gate and here planting seeds. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. Oh, he's here. Uh, Spike. That's Spike, isn't it? Okay, that is Spike, I think. <laughs> yeah, damn.
<laughs> Ooh, damn, this is smooth. Okay. Wow, he's like dancing. Oh, uh, that girl. Oh, what the hell? What's that? Wait, who are these guys? Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, damn. Oh my god. Wait a minute, what? My god, that was. She's not pregnant? What? Oh, so those were like. Oh, okay, okay. Whoa, that was a surprise. I did not expect that. Oh, okay, Jet is here. Well, time to go for a chase. Okay. Well. All right. Wow, there's like water and everything. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Well, What's that? Oh, like the police or something? Wait, what happened? Like, did she kill him? Yeah. And she's going to kill herself as well? I guess yes. Well, yeah, okay, yeah, like those were all the drugs. Well, so this is what the fortune teller was talking about death. Well, Training. Beef with bell pepper. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Oof. That's cool. See you, space cowboy. Okay, I've never heard the op ending song. Like, this is my first time. Hmm. Okay, the voice is quite nice. It's 
स्किल्स में वाओ नाइस दिस दिस एंडिंग इज नाइस Okay, so this guy is like a bounty hunter. So, like as I was saying, um, is a bounty hunter can a bounty hunter be called a mercenary? Um, yeah, um, or not? Like, uh, mercenaries uh, does job for people who are like who pay them. But I think like bounty hunters like do the like pick the job themselves and get paid after that. So like. Like if thought, like if uh, seen. Okay, is this the end? Yeah. So uh, in a broad sense, they are kind of like the uh, like same, but like uh, the bounty hunters has like a choice of picking up the uh, job and doing it, and they do it and they get paid. But uh, like I think mercenaries are like more like uh, like a client hires you, and like you have to do the job what the clients gives you and. Yeah, technically they're the same, but they have like a small bit of difference, like negligible difference. So yeah. Okay, so this was the first episode. I liked it. Like, uh, like what can I say? I can uh, like understand how why people like like this uh, type of shows. Like this is extremely uh, what can I say? Uh, calm, but uh, like a lot of things happened at the same time. It was calm, but still like there was a fight scene and there was action. Uh, there was a nice little story, uh, but it was like. What can I say? Uh, calm and peaceful. Ever, like everything was just like that. Even like in the fighting scenes, they were like done so gracefully and like so smoothly. Like usually, in, like with in anime fight scenes, like uh, we see like people screaming, yeah, ooh, and like they fight, punch, uh, sound effects, fight, uh, like uh, the punching sound effects, the cutting sound effects, uh, like all of these sound effects. Like, like I'm not complaining, complaining about it. Those are good, obviously. Like a good sound effect is definitely. Um, like appreciated like uh, in like a few of the modern shows as well i'm seeing like uh, they are like putting more emphasis on the sound effects but this is nice in itself as well like, this is like a nice like change of pace and people like usually see this like a lot before uh, like uh, like in in the like uh, beginning like when they begin anime they usually like watch cowboy bebop neon genesis evangelion and animes like this but like like i'm an exception to this i like i've never watched this but and this is my first time so i'm uh, like quite impressed uh, seeing the subtle like changes and the things uh, like that this show is uh, showing and the change in the what can i say atmosphere of the anime like this is pretty old uh, i don't know like uh, i know this is quite old but i don't know the exact date uh, just a sec cowboy people let me just check like i'm really, really curious when this anime was made wow 1998 really okay so so yeah like it showed before like uh, 1998 i thought like most probably that was like the studios uh, like founding date or something i thought it was something like that but no so this anime was made in 1998 damn like the animations and everything are so good i i was not expecting this okay wow so all right okay okay so yeah so this is pretty old like in 1998 i was 2 years old <laughs> Okay, two years, isn't it? Yeah. All right. So, wow, this like uh, from April third, nineteen ninety eight to April twenty fourth, nineteen ninety nine. So it it like uh, it was for one year. It went on for one year. Damn. So like in one month, there was like was like I think probably two episodes. That's that why it took uh, like one year completely. Okay so wow that was something like i did not expect at all like uh, like judging by the animations and the, the art style and everything uh, the voice acting and all uh, like i did not expect this at all wow so okay so like yeah like the funny thing is like i've seen animes nowadays which have bad animation style like wor even worse than this so just imagine like in 1998 people were 
making these type of animation like art styled animates and nowadays due to like uh, poor budget and like just lack of what can i say interest and all just for cash grab or money grab like uh, some of the studios uh, like does a sloppy job uh, and people are obviously like mad about that as well like i don't want to take any kind of like animes name about it but i i think like you guys can understand which type of animes i'm talking about uh, one of the animes came out recently and i think you guys know what i'm talking about and that was just like horrendous and i cannot expect even like if uh, an animation studio has l l very less time the uh, people uh, but uh, one thing we have to like uh, take into account is that uh, this anime was uh, f my like uh, airing for about one year so like yeah they had uh, like enough time but still like in 1998 just imagine like like i can't ex like I, I i never expected this to be sold like judging by the art style and all wow like that is really something okay so let's talk about this episode this episode was uh, i'm going to like talk a little bit because i have to do the second episode as well so i'm just like giving me uh, giving a, a small little uh, like impression this was nice uh, i expected this to be good and it did not betray my expectations it was really nice to see like this type of uh, like anime i have not like never seen this type of anime before like this type of atmosphere and all uh, calm and cool thing like uh, atmosphere and everything and it like did not uh, say any kind of uh, like background or anything like i i'm guessing like we have to like understand their backstories and all uh, watching the episodes and like going through the journey they're going to go through so like this is that type of anime which is like we have to like figure out everything so yeah and uh, so this uh, spike is like a um, bounty hunter and he like takes uh, like bounties uh, and like do, does them for money and uh, what else um like i think like this was like a small little like introduction as to like uh what type of a uh, character uh, spike is like spike uh, like we can see like spike i think like spike said stuff uh, what did she say at that time like yeah uh, like when that girl said we're like going to go to mars and uh, like we're going to like uh, live there peacefully and uh, he said something just let me check oh he said that you're planning to escape Mar escaping to mars running away but how far can you go okay okay so i think like just a sec you're not going to catch us your buddy seems to be pretty ill i don't deal with weekend nobodies <clears throat> okay so here it is like i think like uh, Spike would have let let them go if that guy did not come in like and like capture his throat or like tried to choke him. So like he was like at that time he could have like apprehended that guy easily when he was like uh, washing his hands, but he did not do that. And I think like he was like uh, giving them a chance, seeing uh, that the guy had a lady with him and she was like um, her like belly was. Uh, like I, I thought that uh, even I thought that she was pregnant. I did not expect that would happen later on. But anyways, like still, we, even if she was not pregnant, uh, they were like trying to start a new and like start a new life. So I think most probably he would have let them go. But I don't know. This is just my guess. But um, like then that guy came in and like and tried to choke him, and he was able to like snag that piece of like uh, drug, <coughs> and. Uh, yeah and uh, i don't know like uh things could have like gone the other like like the, it could have gotten a different ending but obviously uh like that guy tried to bail out and run away and spike had to go and catch him and unfortunately like uh the police also got like i i think that was like the police i don't know I mean, it's just my like i think uh the police came in and like got to him first and that was like uh what can i say um a bad way to end like like we like i feel sorry for that girl like who had like a dream to uh like live together in peace but unfortunately that was unable to be fulfilled and as we see uh, at the end like even if something like this happened like they have to like carry on with their life and like uh like the thing that is like 
we can like understand from this is like in the beginning of the episode we saw like spike training and all and uh, jet was like making food for him and even at the end that the same scene was happened so like i think the, this tries to show us like even if like some kind of uh, thing like this happens in their life their like uh, their life still goes on like it's just a normal day for them so i think that is like some kind of uh, like uh like um uh, like they shined some kind of um like a little light on their daily happenings and daily uh life like this is something like they has have to like uh go through each and every day and it's normal for them so yeah i think this is like just my I'm me tell like guessing about things so yeah that was nice I, I really enjoyed this episode okay so without further ado i'll be starting episode number um two of cover beep up so yeah i'll be back okay guys i'm back with episode number two of cowboy bebop so i'll be putting the timer and the subtitles here sync it to whichever is your preference and let's get started okay so here's the countdown three two one go mm. okay Um, I'm not sure about like uh, the instruments that are played here like uh, like not instruments like what type of is this like um, I don't know I'm not going to say anything and embarrass myself like I'm really uh, what can I say uh, like I really don't understand the different style of music. like I can uh, differentiate between rock and pop but like uh, jazz and like uh, other type of like electronical death metal i can't like uh, differentiate between them so i'm not going to say anything dumb and like embarrass myself here so yeah this uh, like in a nutshell this is a nice music i really enjoyed this type of like what can i say it has like some kind of like an old vibe um not old but uh, what can i say those type of classic vibes Okay, and th this portion. Okay, wow, that is like some kind. I don't know what what instrument that was, but that was nice. <laughs> All right, what the? Something's in the suitcase. Abdul Hakim. Okay. <laughs> Damn. Woo. What? What? <laughs> well, stray dog strut. Be be bop. Okay, I I always say be pop, not be pop. Be bop. Okay. Big shot, the bounty hunters. Third, third, three hundred thousand. Okay, here's the next one. Serial pet thief. Wait, so that was a pet inside the suitcase? Oh my god. Oh, so like you have to bring these people alive. Hmm. I got his post plus. Oh, 
Fucking money. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Well, that's an easy enough request. Okay, what is this place? Like, like which planet is this? Ooh, like, is that like some kind of artificial atmosphere? Like, I've seen like they're not using oxygen mass, so there's some kind of air, like atmosphere or something that is they use. <laughs> okay. Pets. Those are pet. That guy looks like Leorio <laughs> from Hunter x Hunter. Sugar can hate me. Hmm. What the? Oh no. Um, you're calling for trouble yourself. <laughs> okay, you know. What the? <laughs> Well, he's offering to you nicely, that's like... <laughs> oh no. Okay, someone snagged her, his suitcase. Well... It's gone. Oh, that guy. Uh, I think there will be some kind of an animal inside. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn. Hard luck. Hmm. <laughs> <Yeah. sighs> <sighs> What is this place? Like weapon shop? Hmm. <laughs> Ooh. This guy is Well. Oh. Okay. Oh, this is like this is the same pet shop. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. This is not Hakim. <laughs> Okay, what the hell she's like wearing a tortoise on her head. I thought there was a hat <laughs> Oh, that's a cute doggy
<laughs> with the suitcase. 200. Um, what the hell? <laughs> He's like, what the hell? This can't be Hakim. Like, 200 only? <laughs> oh no. Okay. <laughs> well, that's a great prize. Okay. Oh! Damn, the dog is. <laughs> well. <laughs> Damn, the dog. <laughs> Why is he like uh, wanting that dog so much? Like, it is not even that valuable. Like, is this something else? Wow, the dog. <laughs> Whoa, he is fi okay. Don't throw food at a dog. What the hell? Okay, that was funny. Mm. Two hundred, yeah, I was thinking. <laughs> this dog is like is watching <laughs> wow this dog is clever like <laughs> oh nice nice Oh, okay. <laughs> totally worthless. Well, we, yeah, that's definitely a big one. <laughs> okay. What? Oh, so there is something with, about the dog. Get rid of Oh, so it is some kind of scientific experiment. <laughs> okay. Oh. 
Um, okay, so. <laughs> oh. Pico chan, okay. Um, well, that's obvious. Dog whistle. Well, that's a dog whistle, you can't hear it. Yeah, obviously. Like that frequency is a lot higher than human ears are able to. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, like each and every dog is going to come out now. Well, yeah, it is definitely close. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay. Just married. Oh. <laughs> well, things are going to get crazy here. He got each and every dog other than Oh well Damn, the music. Wow, this is like a wild chase. Oh no, the dog is going to bite him. Or something is going to happen. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wait, what? Damn, the dog is like... <laughs> well... Damn, <laughs> at the police station. <laughs> like, oh god. I, I, I think that they got caught. Yeah, he like <laughs> came crashing in front of a police station. Well. Data dog, yeah. Oh, 
okay so that is the reason why like he was so intelligent <laughs> yeah he, he's with oh no this person <laughs> <laughs> okay, that was good. See you, space cowboy. Okay. Okay, that was nice. <clears throat> okay, this is a good start. Uh, I'm enjoying this quite a bit. And we like have barely like uh, seen the full cast. Uh, I, I think like uh, two or three more people will come. I think two more, isn't it? Like um, that lady and um, from the opening, uh, like uh, another person. I think I, I can't remember how he looked like, but yeah. So like this will be. <laughs> so uh, as far as I can say, this is more like. Um, like uh, the story is obviously continuing from the previous episode but in, this is like more like taking the uh, way of like individual episodes which has like an individual mini story so as far as, as I've seen for the, from the two episodes and I think like uh, like it will be more or like uh, like like that but sometimes I think like they'll merge one or two episodes and make like a bigger story something like that like uh like animes like this uh, like obviously like does that type of thing like usually like the episodes are like mini uh, stories like each and uh, every episode has like a mini individual story but uh, like in the end it is like a huge like big full package of story okay uh so that was uh, episode number 2 all right so yeah these two episodes uh, the first episode i've like uh, already given my sm small impre like my impression and now for this episode uh this episode was uh like getting a new team member basically like uh that uh Korgi, uh they did not give it a name did they no they did not give it a name so i'm going to like uh, mention like uh, address him as the Korgi, unless and until like he gets a proper name so yeah uh, that Korgi was like uh, a new addition to the team and uh, so i was thinking like uh, that dog like did stuff which were uh, like unusual like uh, a dog should not be able to think like that so obviously like that was a data dog and it was like i think experimented upon like or like some kind of uh, uses guinea pig so like that's the reason why like uh, it had like a, a higher intelligence or something like some kind of like some kind of because of some kind of experiment or some kind of uh, test he became like that or it was born like that i don't know but it was special in short and obviously like uh that guy hakim he was uh doing that like him i think most probably he like stole the dog from those other people who like who were the real or like the owner or the people who were uh, doing the experiments on the dog and i think hakim stole it from them and like uh, he was like on his way to um, like sell the dog off to someone who would like understand his value uh, like not f some kind of like a roadside shop uh, like uh, some other kind of higher level people uh, like uh, like uh, who are like at a higher position or who are like as they said collectors and uh, s like people like that or some kind of other organization who would use the dog as some kind of like on other experiments so he was like uh, going on his way for uh, to sell it to them who would understand the real value of the dog but unfortunately uh, because of that uh, these like uh, the original owners of the dog 
they can uh, for him the bounty hunters were also uh, out for him as well and he got sandwiched and like uh, <laughs> the funny thing is like the person who like uh, made all this possible like all of the things that happened in this episode was that guy who was like just trying to like steal something for uh, like a quick buck and uh, like he just wanted to like uh, have some quick uh, like quick little money so he like snagged that back <laughs> and like uh, <laughs> like if he did not get uh, provoked at that uh, scene where like the guy was like pushing him and saying like hey you can't understand what i'm saying uh, are you not listening uh, stuff like that and if he like did not get provoked at that and like did those stuff like putting that cockroach into that drink and forcing him to drink he would not get distracted and none of this would have happened and uh, like <laughs> like, he, like the guy took that uh, chance and snacked that suitcase and ran off and like what can i say like that simple like that simple thing uh, fully like um, blew him over and like every, all of his plans and everything that he like wanted to do like went down the drain and <laughs> like that guy even that guy did not get what he want he was unable to like uh, the only people who profited from this episode were the police like just think about it like neither that neither did spike uh, and like uh, the, the, his crew profit like, yeah we can say like he profited in one way that is uh, he got a new team team member the dog uh, like uh, was added to the gang yeah that is kind of like one profit uh, but other than that the thing that they were after that is that is the bounty money they did not get it uh, neither did Hakim get anything for like all of the stuff that he did like uh, stealing uh, pets and all he got arrested uh, neither did the guy who like initially snagged that suitcase get anything he, like uh, <laughs> like uh, he like like everyone like got bad luck he has to like uh, sweep up the <laughs> um, uh, pet shop for all the commotion that he made um, Hakim got arrested that's a bad luck the people who were after Hakim, that is like those researchers or all, uh, they did not get anything out of it, uh, even they get ar got arrested. And uh, what else? And the pet shop owner also like had m minor some kind of inconveniences when all of their dogs like uh, pets started running out. So yeah. <laughs> and uh, like, like, like uh, everything went kind of nuts in this episode, like all bad luck. And just because of like one single dog. <laughs> and yeah like uh, like I'll like that dog was like really smart like I could like uh, obviously from like the things that we we're doing like he was like extremely intelligent that like the way he like dodged the um, like net that they uh, put put out to capture him and then like he pressed the buttons of the car and like uh, removed the steering wheel and all like and then jumped at the same time like those were like highly intelligent moves on him like which is uh, not possible for a dog to come up with so obviously like, i think like uh, this dog will be like a lot useful if like it stays with our crew i don't know if it will stay with uh, spice stream or not i'm hoping it will uh, and uh, like uh, it will be what can i say exciting to see what that dog uh, like does in the future episodes like uh, like he's intelligent so i'm hoping like he will like uh like use his intelligent to like help uh spike and jet in the future um what can i say adventures and all so yeah <laughs> like as positive um what can i say addition to the team so yeah that was this episode that was a nice episode the dog was cute as well like <laughs> yeah and um yeah that's it that was this episode so uh, like these two episodes were quite a nice start uh, i'm enjoying this anime uh, quite a bit and i as as far as i've heard like this gets better so i'm quite excited <coughs> excuse me i'm quite excited to see uh, what this anime is all about and what happens uh, in the later episodes so yeah guys so that is like uh, my blind reaction to uh, cowboy bebop and i'll be continuing this series um uh, like i'll be back with uh, another two episodes in the next week uh, so yeah if you guys enjoyed my reaction press the like button subscribe if you're new to the channel or you haven't subscribed 
because that helps me a lot and um, be sure to uh, comment down below anything you want to share anything you want to say about this episode and like if i'm wrong about something or like i'm misunderstanding something about the episodes uh, not just this episode but in the future episodes as well uh, if you guys stick around uh, if you see like uh, me misunderstanding something uh, without like spoiling anything on, on all you should definitely like correct me if i'm wrong about something in the comment section as well uh, i'll be sure to check them and uh, yes so that was a really like a good start and uh, i'm enjoying this a lot so yeah i'll be back with two new episodes of cowboy bebop in the next week so until then goodbye and have a nice day